Just, uh, I want to put you on the spot here. Looking at that squad and looking at maybe, especially those developmental players from uh, Europe, England in particular, does this tell you that uh, Brito is trying to qualify for the World Cup or let's say it's maybe I'm trying to build a team for the future? What are you reading from the squad? I think he's trying to build a, a squad for the future because if you look at these boys, some of them, they are under 23s and it, or even under 20. So for them to come down here, and it, it's something that they really need to experience before they even start playing. For exposure, and it, in terms of football. And it, like imagine Tinashe Garanga. Munashe. Eh, Munashe Garanga. And it's, it's a very good feeling. You know, days go national team. Then you come down and it, you meet, you know, boys from your own country. And it, for the first time, and it's, and I experienced that. Imagine in any when I was growing up, I wanted to play alongside Peter and Love and Shagai Tika in my career. So that's something uh Tika with these boys. And so no exactly to bring in those boys. Because I England, Marvelous Nakamba, I think is the one that we can even use. And could Angaji Taura no Hafana you know what boys? We can go and represent Zimbabwe. One day we can even qualify for World Cup. So we're not thinking about that for this qualification campaign? No. This is the time to build our national team, Mr. Tish, for the future, not for the next World Cup.